Hey everyone, bringing you this 2018 Dodge Journey crossover uh, today. This vehicle offers many different options, uh, whether it's navigation, sunroof, heated seats and steering wheels, even third row seating, uh, which we will go over as we make our way throughout the vehicle. Um, just starting off here, you are going to have a V6 engine, um, so you'll have plenty of power with, with this Dodge Journey. As you can see, goes without saying, beautiful rug color with the dark black um, accents as well as the silver. You do have the fog lights here in the front. Making our way around, you can see these tires are basically in perfect condition, 19 and a half inch rims, three quarter tread or better as a guarantee with all, um, all things automotive. Here you do have the proximity option. As far as having your keys in your pocket, you can lock and unlock your car door without getting them out. Looking on the inside, all black leather, very, very, very clean car. You can see that it has the accent um, stitching, which is very nice, sleek, and sophisticated. We will go through the rest when we get to the driver's side, um, but I will go ahead and show you the checklist that the technician signed off on, and I will show you what the brake pad life and the tire life looks like. So tires, you're looking at 12, 30 seconds. Brake pads, you are looking at 17 and 15, 30 seconds. So no fear with those, everything is in great condition. Um, and we will make our way around. From the middle row, as mentioned, this is um, does offer third row seating. So for the middle row, plenty of leg like, space. Uh, you do have your temperature controls for the back here um, as well. And then we will get to that beautiful sunroof uh, when we make our way around as well. From the back, you can see that you do have the proximity sensors, um, so you don't have to worry. It will notify you if you are getting too close to anything when you are um, backing up. You can also see that you do have the backup camera, which I will show you when we are in the driver's side then as well. I will go ahead and show you what the trunk space looks like while we are back here. So we do have the third seat, uh, third row lifted. Uh, so you can see that you do still have some storage space back here with it uh, up. You do also have additional space down here if there's anything that you want to keep covered. To fold this down, simply pull up on the strap, push it forward. The seat would have to, the middle seat would have to be moved up a little bit further, but you get the idea. You would have plenty of space back here um, if you were to need to put this, sec this third row down. Again, you can see that the tires are in great condition. Moving around here. You can see that the middle row seats are manual as far as sliding them forward or flipping the seat up. I will go ahead and flip this one up here for you a little bit just to give you an idea of what this back row is going to look like. So this gives you the option of having seven passenger as um, compared to the five. But you do have a lot of space back here. Have the middle console there with additional cup holders, which is always nice. You do have the charging option back here then as well. And again, the heating and cooling option. Powered windows. We will go ahead and hop on in here and get this thing started. you're going to have a very nice um, touch screen display here. It's going to give you the option to control your navigation, do your heated seats for both the passenger and driver's side as well as the heated steering wheel, AM, FM, satellite radio, as well as Bluetooth, um, your phone, and do the backup camera. So we'll just go ahead and go through some of these. Your navigation, nice bright big screen there for you. Climate, again, you have the um, option of your heated seats, heated steering wheel, dual temperature um, for both you and your passenger so you can ride comfortably, which again will be listed there as well. You do have a CD player 
And then again, the AM, FM radio. I am going to go ahead and slide this in reverse to give you an idea of what the backup camera looks like. Moving over here to the steering wheel, you do have your Bluetooth options um, as well as your cruise control. To the left here, we're going to have your lights and then on your door, you're going to have your mirror and window controls as well. As previously mentioned, you can see it does have under 23,000 miles on it. Uh, so for a 2018, it's very low mileage. Up here, you can see that we do have the sunroof. So a great feature to let in some natural air. You do have your OnStar as well as sunglass holder. And then that is for your sunroof. Looking here, you can see that we do have the Carfax report. Does have two owners. One was as a rental and one was as personal use. But again, 2018 and low mileage. We will go over any sort of imperfections when we get back out of the car, but I just want to show you your glove box as well as some storage here. Another charging option. Then you do actually have some more storage down here with your USB and your auxiliary. So we'll go ahead and turn this off and hop out and then we'll go around and just show you any sort of imperfections that um, I may have noticed as I was walking around. So going through here, just a little chip there on the front. Some little minor dings here. Nothing that is too noticeable. A little bit right here. But again, as a used vehicle, this is something that would be expected. But overall, it's in great condition. On the back side, not really even any marks from the, someone putting something in or out of the vehicle. Um, which again would be common, but this one doesn't have it. As mentioned previously, all of the rims are in great condition. The leather interior is remarkable. So if you are looking for um, a Dodge Journey and you're thinking that this could be a great option for you, please check us out online at allthingsautomotive.com. Give us a call at 717-485-4224. Um, or come down to 21518 Great Cove Road and uh, check it out. Thanks and have a great day.